Next on the tee, from Gushen, Kentucky, please welcome Have a good day. Mr. Justin Thomas. When Justin Thomas tees it up on the PGA Tour, one particularly interested observer keeps a close watch. Yeah, it's fine. His father and coach, Mike. Look at that thing go left. Looks like if you get it just barely to the right, it comes right down off the green. But this connection through golf reaches more than just one round. Ah, that's a little better start than the last couple of days. It embodies an entire life in the game. Justin! He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead, Daddy. I was playing a lot competitively when he was born, so when he was just a baby, he was here all the time. He's not supposed to have on blue jeans here at the club, you know that? Look at this. The membership grasped onto him here, loved having him around here. While Justin Thomas grew before his parents' eyes, Justin. so too did his interest in golf. Oh, good shot, all right. Hit it. He was not quite two yet, and he asked me for a golf club. Yay! <laughs> I teach for a living. So it was a natural progression for me to teach him. How's your hands go? Yeah. There you go, good boy. Yeah. Oh, good shot. You're hitting them good, Big J. I made a commitment at a very early age of his that I wanted to be his friend as much as his father. Okay. You're the man. You're the man. <laughs> he's my son, but he's my buddy. Dad's a great guy. I mean, he's uh, he's been my coach my whole life and one of my best friends my whole life. Hi, Daddy. Hi, Daddy. We could kind of all go out and play together and enjoy moments on the golf course. It was cool. There you go. <laughs> That's how Daddy does it, huh? Yeah. The golf bug in our family definitely is there and not alive for sure. Whoa. Whoa. Now you need your wedge. I mean, my dad and my grandpa, we have a lot of good memories. Many of which are still living where Justin grew up in the game. Do you have any idea how old you were when you used that wedge? Uh, I mean, I would have to, some like eight, something oh, like I that, would say six. He's smaller than yeah. that, yeah, yeah, six. And he's worn the grooves right off of it. Yeah, smooth as silk. <laughs> you know, people always ask, uh, well, did you know he was going to be good? Well, that's the answer right there. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, his, his club didn't get like that. I mean, he, he hit that many balls. Get up! Oh, I think you got a good kick. It's all right, stayed on. The way he started out when he was young. Ah. You could tell that that wasn't the average golfer coming up. My goodness, that might be on. He was hitting the ball solid every single time. Good shot. It was at a high level early and never stopped. If you were around and watched him when he was seven and eight years old, good one, huh? winning was everything. We have the overall champ for the age group six to seven, Justin Thomas. He just had this desire, a little secret thing in him that uh, he loved competition. Big J, here we are at our first tournament ever, right? Yeah. You ready to rock and roll, are you? Better get your clubs there, Slick. Ooh. You might need those, huh? Wanna give me a smile? E